What is going on YouTube? My name is Matt and I'm here to bring you all some more dramatics. More Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door for all you mushroom fans out there. Last episode, Mario went to Hooktail Castle and got his first crystal star. And then we ended with uh, Peach. We're um, currently controlling Peach. Now I don't know which way to go. Check, what's this? Nothing. <laughs> I can hide in lockers. I wonder if that'll be something. Okay, can I go? Hmm, it's not opening. Huh. Yeah, what was up with this whole peach thing? What's she doing? No, what was that about? Hey, how odd. The doors open by themselves. Something's up. Something's weird. Something weird is going on. Oh, it's back here. A shower? A lovely shower. No soap scum even. Wow, I wonder if it works. Oh. Ah, uh, hee hee. Now <laughs> she's getting clean real quick. Let me, you know, get proper. You know. Aw, how refreshing. I feel like a new princess. Or she scrubbed him sparkly clean. How oddly considerate of them. <laughs> Oh, her hair came back to- I mean, she's- yeah, it, it don't matter, but that was cool that she- like, how she had her hair up. Weird. It doesn't look like anyone's around. Yeah, what are- we're in the- so we're in the x knots. She's been captured by the x knots. I mean, go check out the other, you know, go check out the other episodes and you'll figure that out. But she's been captured by the x knots. so right now, just wandering through their laboratory? Their base. How do I keep making these doors open? How odd. I wonder if it's. <laughs> I wonder if she doesn't. I wonder if they're like motion sensing and she doesn't realize she's stepping on the pad to motion to make it move and she's never seen this before. <laughs> Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? What? Who said that? Where are you? How amusing. I am right here before your eyes. I am this laboratory's main computer. I am the tech X -X, Tech double X. <laughs> Many call me tech. You may. Sir Grotos created me to be a perfect computer. One that is flawless in its reasoning. Grotos? What? Wait, he's that awful dome-headed thing who interrogated me, right? Sir Grotos is not awful. He is a very great person. He is marvelous. Well, I don't think so. But I doubt I'll change your mind, so I'm wondering, why did you lead me in here? An unusual program deviation occurred when I observed you just after you brought you were brought here. My higher brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. <laughs> ah, he's smitten on the princess. He's in love. He's in love with Princess Peach. He he thinks she's he thinks she's beautiful. She's uh I'm thinking of trying to think of something dumb, but I can't think of anything on the top of my head. He's he thinks she's prettier than a peach. Oh, <laughs> yeah, no, as pretty as a peach. Also, okay, let me let me just get back to reading. Also, an unidentified impulse bed sped through my processors. These events are new to me. There is more to this phenomenon as well. I ran diagnostic programs and their solution was I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. Such a compulsion has no precedent. Cause unknown. I, the perfect computer. I must diagnose this unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wait, did you just say you want to observe me? To know more about me? Could it be that you... No, impossible. It can't be. You're a computer. 
What has happened to me? If you know my malfunction, you must tell me of it. Oh, I couldn't really... Because... It's just too weird. <laughs> Please tell me. Please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. There should be nothing. There should not be anything that I do not understand. Please. Well, you know, maybe it is possible that, well, you're in love with me. <laughs> love? What is love? I cannot compute this. Wait, you don't know what love is? Love, how do I explain? Love tells you when you want to be with the person forever. It makes you feel happy just to see that person happy, smiling, having fun. When you love someone, you will do anything to help when that to help when that person is in trouble. Happiness, fun. I have definitions for these words, but my programming is insufficient. There should be nothing I cannot comprehend. I am the perfect computer. Comprehend love? Love's not something you comprehend, Tech. You feel it. Princess Peach, will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? What? You're a computer! Why would you care about love? I am perfect. There must be nothing that I cannot comprehend. Nothing. That is why you must help me understand this thing called love, please. If you have any wish that I can grant you in exchange, I will grant them. But of course I am unable to grant such a wish as letting you escape. I cannot believe this. You ex-jerks kidnapped me before I could even begin to enjoy my vacation. And now you call me in here to ask me to teach you the meaning of love? I should spit in your screen. You'll grant me wishes? Ha! Huh. Why should I believe you? There you go, Peach. Tell him. Tell him. No. Let him know what's up, girl. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I love Peach. I understand. <laughs> oh, sorry. <clears throat> Ooh, I have to get rid I understand you are angry. That emotion I comprehend. You need not teach me now. But I must learn of this thing. I must. There is no alternative. I must be the perfect. I must be a perfect computer. This is why. If you would just to consider teaching me, I will grant your wishes. Do you understand me, Princess Peach? Now, tell me your wish. Are you sure? Well, okay, here goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send wireless mail to anywhere you want. If you so wish, you can use it right now. There is no trouble. Use the keyboard in front of you. Enter the recip recipient, address, and message. You mean this keyboard? Alright, let me give this a shot. Okay, it's ready, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return to your room. I will call you in again when I want to ask you something. Uh, okay then. Good night. Crazy ass computer. Good night, Princess Peach. Good night, Princess Peach. Waka 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 wa. Bowser saving. I just, I don't know. Making noises. Da 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 da. Look at those Koopas with armor on them. And the Hammer Bros. Ha <laughs> ha! Hammer Koopas. Bowser is the first time we've seen him in this game. <laughs> Bowser the Mighty Koopa King has arrived! Hold your applause, minions! Now that I'm here, Cammy! You crusty old hag, where did you summon me? Why did you summon me? Why? Why? Uh, Great Lord Bowser, the uh, crusty hag Kami Koopa will arrive momentarily. I'm really sorry for the inconvenience, but please wait at the rear of the room. Yeah, we're s Wah! <laughs> yeah, yeah! Get 
to the rear. Get to the rear. Oh, look at him. Look at the mustache. Or is that his dad? Yeah, Lord Bowser. <laughs> She's taking a while to get the... She's taking a while. <laughs> Ooh. I just returned. I am terribly sorry to keep you waiting, my lord. I bet you are, Cammy Koopa. Now, out with it. Why have you called me here? Please, your grumpiness. I don't be so impatient with your poor servant. <coughs> it's my displeasure to report that Mario, that scum, is off to a town called Rogueport. <laughs> I am Mario's baby. Am I Mario's babysitter? I don't care what he's doing. Are you going to call me every time that guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Yes, well, you see, my lord, apparently Mario was haunting for an is hunting for an amazing treasure. Tre treasure? Yes, Mario has gone in search of star-shaped jewels known as the Crystal Stars. I'm, search I'm researching just what they are, but there's no question of their high value. Crystal Stars, you say? They sound like good world-conquering tools. I want them! Yes! Yes, very good! Continue research from this. Continue researching for this. Researching this for me, you brainy hag, you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? I do. I do. I love fried eggs. Love them, but what a weird question. Why do you ask? Well, during my Mario recon, I stopped in a lovely place called Petal Meadows. I was planning to ta on taking everyone there for a picnic, for having some eggs and toast. Of course, it, I wouldn't think of sending out invites without asking you first, Lord Bowser. <laughs> Long card! A picnic? Get serious! A picnic? Are you serious? Get serious! This is no time for fun! See, this is why my evil plans always derail! Because you clods goof off! <laughs> ah! Oh dear, Lord Bowser, please calm down. Remember your blood pressure. Hmm? What is that? Mumble mumble. What? Is this true? Lord Bowser, terrible news. Some bold fool abducted Princess Peach in Rogueport. <laughs> what? Tell me you're lying, Cammy. How? When? Where? Who'd do such a thing? Besides me. <laughs> Besides me, yes, who would do such a thing? I'm afraid we don't have that information quite yet. The investigation's going on. One thing is most certainly confirmed, however. The princess has been kidnapped. Under no circumstances is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say-so. I will not stand for this. I'm going to Rogueport now. I've got to kidnap her back. Oh, he just... Okay. But your grun grunginess. Wait up. Did you say grunginess? <laughs> Why do you have to make a whole hole in... A big ass hole in the wall, Bowser? <laughs> he looks so... He looks so funny in that thing for some reason. I don't know why. Alright, are we back to Mario now? I think we are. Coops, my lad, are you telling me that you're going with Mario? Um, that's right, Dad. I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. And then I'm, well, I'm going to come back a strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nicely said, young Coops. That's my boy. But always remember this. You are my son, Coops, and I am your father. Yes. Facts that were already known. Coops, my sweet, I'll be right here waiting for you to prove yourself. <clears throat> Mad, if anything happens, you can always come home, Coops. Don't you ever forget that. This village will always be your home. Okay, thank you, everyone. Well, I'm off. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know, farewells. So, where are we going? Let's head back to Rogueport. Remember, Mario? How old the magical map aloft to pour the entrance to the thousand-year door. And the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. And it didn't stop there. Each stone of yesterday will shine and paint point towards the next in line. That's what the books say. Which means if we take the crystal star we found back to the thousand-year door, 
So that means the location of the next crystal star will appear on that magical map? Exactly! Come on, let's go! Alright, we gotta go all the way back to freaking Rogueport now. Uh, what is this mail? Hello, Mario. Still working hard. Professor Frankly here in email E form. Again, I do have more to say, as it turns out. Gubella was eager to join your side, and, and she won't be the last. I'm sure they'll have a bunch of partner. Oh, partner? Okay. Okay. Cool. Oops, just right. I, will, I just. I like to have Gumbella out first so I can do the tattle and then just switch it back. Okay, are we gonna. Are you gonna be okay now, guy? Uh, I guess he's still sad. He's still sad. Let's go over here real quick. Wow, you saved up 10 shot points and earned yourself a free mushroom! Hell yeah! Okay. Can I sell? Oh, you can store. I'd rather just sell. Goddamn end coupon, I'm gonna have to use that temporarily for some. store that okay <laughs> mr. softener <laughs> that sounds gross Alright, let's leave it at that. Now let's go. Let's go. Sorry. Okay, go. Go out the door. I forgot. I gotta push the button. Alright, alright. Let us head back to Rogueport. Figure out where the fuck we need to go next. It's a long way back to the old Rogueport. <clears throat> you know, Mario, I just realized we found a crystal star, but not Princess Peach. Where do you think she went? I hope she's alright. You okay? You're totally shaking. Do you need a bathroom? Uh -huh. Dear, dearest Mario, I send this letter and hope that it reaches you safely. I am being held against my will in some strange place. Though I do not know where I am, I remain unharmed and in relative comfort. Those who have captured me seem to be after the map I sent you earlier. They may be hoping to use it to find these objects they call the Crystal Stars. I do not know what they are planning, but I have a feeling it is not anything positive. They may be aware, they may be aware that you have the map, so please be very careful. And please, do not worry about me. Princess Peach. Whoa, wait a second. Isn't that from Princess Peach? THE Princess? So that means she's okay, for the moment, anyway. But that's better than not knowing, right? And now we know another thing. Whoever kidnapped her is also after the Crystal Stars. We should get back to Rogueport and start searching for the next Crystal Star. Pronto, that's what I'm trying to do! Oh, well, struck first. Cool. Just some gooms. Nice. Right. Oh, yeah, now we have two star points. That's awesome. <clears throat> Let's see if we can avoid these goddamn enemies for right now. Cause we don't need we don't need them. Damn it! No. I'm gonna beat him. I'm 
and smash him. Smash him! Two points. Wow. Excuse me. Well, there's Hooktail's Castle, so... We're close. Uh, where we go? We got... There we go. Let's go down the pipe. No, get out of here! I gotta go down first. I gotta go down first, Goombella. <laughs> Damn it. You made me go all the way back there. <laughs> Kumbella just jumped right in. I'm here now that I can go there. Oh, whoa! The heck is this? Hello, welcome. I'm Merly. Underground, cute as can be, charming charmer. That is me. <laughs> Lucky for you, uh, I'm coming here. I could grant good fortune, I have no fear. Let my mystic power tell of days to come. More as well, for luck sits on my spells. What do you say, Mr. Guy? I want to give it a try. No, nah, I'm good. You know what? Actually, yeah, let's try it. Cast a spell! Special path. Okay, that's fine by me. So, ready, ready for me? Okay, here we go. My mystic powers can make you smile in battle. You'll win with style. Even if nasty foes arrive, you'll be so fine since my fortune will thrive. Okay, come again. See you soon. So the see you soon then. See you then. Goodbye. Fucking weird, strange. We gotta go this way, right? Woo -woo. Okay, we can do a lot more now that we have some stuff. We can go visit, look in some things. Oh, that's water. Frick. What's over here? Whoa. The shit is that? I don't think we can get that yet. Okay, go down here. Damn it. I jumped right into him. I don't think I have one of these. That's a spinnia, uh, a totally weird creature made of thin, papery boards. It certainly looks unique. Nobody knows much about these creatures, actually. HP 3, attack 1, defense 0. Attacks are super swift, but it should be pretty easy. Just give it a hia. A hia, you say. Damn it. Oh, 
Ah, what just happened? Okay. Okay. Can I break this shit? No. Can't do that. I think the door is this way. Wait, let's go. What's this? Way? What's this? Yeah, is this the door? Oh no, that's the chest. Yeah, oh baby. I'm getting that I'm getting the hang of that plane and plane and here we are. Go through here. Oh, oh, go through here. Jump, jump. Okay, now it's over here. The heck? Danger, do not enter this pipe is the entrance to the pit of a hundred trials. First attack and first attack and bump attack badges don't work, so beware. Whoa. Deepest level reach is the- oh, okay, so I guess this is weird. Interesting. Let's not do that right now. Not going to do that yet. Alright. Let's go do this. Let's give this star. Okay, Mario, you ready? Hold that crystal star up. Oh, I'm like, am I supposed to do something? <laughs> we did it! Oh, star power. Where is it going next? The forest? Some kind of... Oh yeah, boogly woods. Boggly wood, sorry, not boogly. I keep saying boogly. Boogly. Green stars next. Location of a crystal star has been recorded on your magical me app. Me magical me app. Oh, check it out, Mario. The location of the next crystal star has appeared. But I have no idea where that is. <laughs> cool. Okay, I guess we ought to show the map to Professor Frankly. Now I gotta go talk to that old coot. Alright, okay, well at least it takes us straight to there, I think. Hopefully. I think that's what's happening. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Crystal clear. Yeah. Yes, great pun. Come on, where's the next crystal star, Professor? <laughs> It is in Bogley Woods. The second crystal star is inside the great tree there. A great tree in Bogley Woods? Okay. About those woods, I think some odd creatures live there. If memory serves, there's a pipe beneath town that leads to those woods. By the way, Professor, about Princess Peach. Not long ago, Mari received an email from her. It said that the people who kidnapped her are also looking for the crystal stars. Oh, and the worst part? She said that she doesn't even know where she is. Uh-oh. If Princess Peach's kidnappers are also looking for the crystal stars, that could... What could they hope to achieve? That could it be... Could the treasure be... Huh? Too many unknowns! Unfortunately, the only clues we could rely on are the crystal stars in that map. And we'll head for Bogley Woods to... <laughs> Bogley, Bogley. Bogley Woods to find the next crystal star. Let's do it! Yes, I recommend you just do just that. Try to find it before the princess's captors. Whatever their ultimate goal is, it can be good. Can't be good. But don't be hasty. If you're low on your items or health, drop by the shop and in first. I'll keep researching this learn and learn more about the crystal stars and their ancient treasure. 
Alright, so we're going to Bogley. Weege! Well, hey, big brother. Fancy meeting you here. What a coinky dink. Hey, what am I up to? Well, bro, I'm on an adventure. I have a princess. I have to rescue Princess Eclair of the Waffle Kingdom. Yeah, it's a bad scene, all right. She's been kidnapped by the evil Chestnut King. You gotta know, I met I met with some Waffle King cabinet members to the the other day. It was pretty intense, bro. Want to hear what happened? It's a long story. I met with cabinet. <laughs> I met with the Waffle Kingdom cabinet members the other day. Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. My big brother, my big brother, that's you, bro, got a letter from Pizza's Peach and took off. Left behind as usual, I was cooking a snack at home when another letter arrived. We don't get much mail, so I was thinking, huh, this is what the letter said. Sirs, my name is Crep. I am a cabinet minister on the far-off Waffle Kingdom. Our land has been attacked by the Chestnut King who took our Princess Eclair. I ask, nay, beg for your assistance. The Waffle Kingdom need your assist need your skills. I humbly request your prompt response, sirs. Sincerely, Crate. Look at Mario and Kubella. See, they're asleep. Well, I don't th I don't remember it exactly, but I think it went something like that. With Mario, that's you, bro. Gone. Fell it gone. It fell to me <laughs> to answer this plea. Hesitating only a teensy bit, I headed to the Waffle Kingdom to investigate. Oh no! First, I wrote a note to myself about what I was cooking. Then I left. Once I reached the Waffle Kingdom, I met Minister Crep, who filled me in. The Chestnut King had kidnapped Princess Eclair and vanished. Apparently, though, some oracle said a marvelous com compass would locate her. This marvelous compass had been broken into seven parts by an ancient curse. Is this the same story, but just different? Like, for the Thousand Year Door. And then, and those parts had been scattered across the land. Can you believe it, bro? Each part of the marvelous compass was said to point to the next. And since one of the parts was embedded in the tiara worn by the princess, it's surmised that I, once I collected all the parts, I'd find her. Smart, huh? The minister gave me the compass base. Uh, the minister gave me the compass base spoken of in waffle fa 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 fables. In waffle fables, when it activated, the entire thing lit up, indicating the deep south. It was I was it was pointing me towards Rumble uh, Rumble Bump Volcano on the Pudding Continent. <laughs> so here I am. I am sailing out of Rogueport for Rumble Bump Volcano. It's probably going to be pretty dangerous, but I got to rescue that princess. Want to hear about something else? <laughs> nah, I'm good, Weed. If you want to hear about what I've been up to, just come find me, okay? I'll be around. Alright, so... I'm not, gonna, I'm not missing anything, am I? Who are you? Hey, hey, yo, I got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further. Earthquake? Oh, are these like... Whoa. What, is that Wario? Change Mario's clothes into... That's awesome. I'm gonna do it. I gotta get more coins. What a deal. I'm gonna change my products from time to time. So Damn it, really? So he might change his shit. Am I ever gonna be able to get past you? Yeah, am I ever gonna be able to get past that lady? I'm looking back here. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just go. I think I just got to go back down. Um, the pipe. Yeah, good luck down the pipe. come all the way here you must have seen some dangerous action that's good dangerous good believe me I know oh there's this thing right there how the heck oh a star piece right here too holy crap 
What do you want, chump? If you got ain't got business here, then beat it. Okay, I guess later. All right, well, let's just uh, have to figure that out later. Ah, see, so that's the door. That's the locked door. What about you, people? What's over here? Is there some way I can get on it from over here? Maybe not. Hmm. Okay, well, let's just go. Sorry, I'm wasting time. And that I went the wrong way. You gotta go down this pipe over here. Hey! Check my emails. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. Let's just go. Let's go. That thing, what was that? The what was that? Wow. One second, I think so. Yeah, someone done that pipe, but oh, hey, you, you're right here. My name is Dazzle, and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the happier I am. So, guy, if you have any star pieces, trade my ooh, badges. A Ten hot hog. Interesting. I will come back later for you. What? You changed your mind? Oh, come on. Ah, welcome, Mario. Uh, fortune teller, single my business. Okay, humble job. No, okay. Nope. Don't want you. Never mind. I thought you were somebody different. Sorry. <laughs> I just smacked the shit out of her. Alright, let's go down this pipe. Oh, there it went. Go slip right through here. Pull, pull, pull. Just a little sideways shuffle. Ram. Mario, did you see that? That was that one of those things that Professor Frankly described. Oh, I know. I'm going after it. Huh. Eek! Don't, don't eat me! Hmm? Huh? Y you didn't come to eat me? And you're not bullies? Guess again, nerd! Get ready for a solid n megaton nookie. Nookie, nookie, nookie. <laughs> I've screwed that up. That's hilarious. Guess again, nerd! No, of course not. We're Mario. Mario's not a bully. For, for real? Phew, boy, that's good. I thought for a second I might have an accident. You're one of the creatures from Boggly Woods, right? What are you doing here? Well, what? Why do you know about me? No, you, you must be... You guys are working for those x knots aren't you? You chased me here. N no, it's the end. x knots Easy there, kid. What in the world are you freaking out about? We're not going to do anything to you, so just chill for a second. Just tell us what's going on. Well, 
Okay, this gang of bad guys who call themselves x knots came to where I live. They came inside our great tree and started tearing apart and causing trouble. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I think I need a drink of water. Give me a second. Ah! I don't know how air goes down the wrong pipe, but yeah, let's just carry on and forget about that. So I've come all the way here looking for help. I need help. Mario, that sounds like those guys who attacked us in Rogueport, right? If they're the same guys, then they're definitely after the Crystal Star. Now that you mention it, they did say something about some Crystal Star thingy. But we punies, aw <laughs> oh, punies, don't know anything about any crystals or stars. Say, could you guys help us out? Maybe chase them off? If you do, we'll give you, uh, what was it, the Crystal Star? If you do, we'll have the puny elder give you that. I don't know what it is, but if it'll help us reclaim our tree, I'm sure the Elder will agree. So what do you say? Let's not waste any more time. I'm begging you. Really? You aren't joking? You'll do it? I guess, I mean, you can't just ignore them, right? And we do need to find the Crystal Star before those X-whatever guys do. Oh, thank you so much. This is great. I'm so happy. My name is Punio. <laughs> Punio. I'm pleased to meet you, like Mario, but puny style. I'll take you wherever I live. Follow me, okay? It's this way. Wait, hang on a second. I'm sure the puny elder said something. Said I'm sure the puny elder said some button around here opened the secret entrance. Aha! Found ya. Can I go this way? Yes. Give me this. What is this? Is it a badge? Damage dodge. Boost defense by one with the successful guard action command by Mario. Oh, and then go this way. Nice. You can get to the woods we punies live in by going through that pipe there. Okay, hurry, hurry. All right, let's go through. Here we go to the boggly. Ooh! Chapter 2, the great boogly tree. It's boggly, but I call it the boogly tree. We made it to the next chapter, y'all. Ooh! Okay, let's, um, I forgot. I gotta press A to continue. Ooh, I like this color and stuff. This is nice. Boggly Woods. Those are the boggly wood. These are the boggly woods. They sure look boggling. Oh, I got butterflies. Oh, I've got butterflies. Okay, um, uh, just a bit further and we should be able to see the great tree. The other and her friends are waiting for us there. Oh, and my little sister too. Come on, let's go. Anything in here? You know, something could just be hiding in here, don't you think? Don't you think? You know what I'm saying, kid? Alright, let's go, let's go. Oh, those witches! Meehee! <laughs> Time to go to work, lovelies! Vivian, you understand what we've got to do, yes? Mm-hmm. Find that Mario g A, find that Mario guy, and B, steal the map, the crystal stars, right? We can just do away with Mario and his friends, can't we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad thing- bad things happen all the time, Vivian, but you're right about our goals. If my information is correct, Mario should be coming down this road quite soon. You must ambush him and get that map! Hmm? What's this now? Vivian, what's that you're fra fawning uh, over there? Oh, what do you mean this? I found it near that tree over there a while back. Isn't it a gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely, I just had to pick it up. Hm. Vivian, for shame. Picking up something someone scraps? Disgusting. Greedy. But enough about that. Vivian, my dear pack rat, bring out the sketch of that Mario guy that you got from Grotto. Smoohee. <laughs> Eve, what? I, I don't have that. You said it was way too important. You said it was way too important, so you took it. You should have it. 
I don't be ridiculous. I don't have that thing. You were in charge of it. You wretched little worm. Blaming me for something you probably screwed up. But I... Huh? Uh-oh, they saw him. Gah, gah. Oh, what is it now? What is it, Marilyn? Huh? What? Is that a mustachioed fellow? This is no time for such nonsense, you great oaf. Save your games for later. Now, now, where was I? You, Vivian. Don't tell me you lost our precious sketch. But, listen, I... Look, it's not my fault. I never had the sketch. Silence, you dits. Such impudence. Impudence. How dare you talk back to me like such some rebellious child. It's clear to me that the only rationale what you un rationale you understand is force. For your punishment, I'll be taking that necklace you just found. Yes, so sorry. But, but, Bedlam. Oh, you're horrid. Do we fight him? Nah. Oh, what am I to do? What is it, Mr. Mustache? Leave us scram right now. I have no business with you. Uh, go, go. I don't know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we just walk past him. I wonder if we fight him later or something. Ooh, save it. Oh, God. Who are these guys? And I got one of you? It's a cleft, a rock head jerk with spikes in its noggin. What a rocker. <laughs> Max HP is 2, attack 2, defense 2. That hard head is a major pain. Fire doesn't hurt it, but other types of items are pretty effective, usually. If nothing seems to work or not, you can always just run. Well, I got the power block. Nice. Now piranha plants. I don't want to jump. Okay, what do we got? That's a pale piranha. You know about these guys, the famous piranha plants. And this colorless species is adapted to boggy woods. Ah, the wonders of nature. HP 4, attack 2, defense 0. If you try to jump on them, they'll totally chomp on you. Yep, knew it. I knew it. Woo! That was a close one. Nice! Finally got it, bingo. Just defend. Get out of here. Okay, six points. Hoping they'd give a little bit more. There's this honey syrup back here, just sitting here. Dang it, just ran in. Dang, three of them, eh? way too early. There we go. Alright, 
that. We need one more. Now we got just one more to take down. Get out of here. Man, let's go. Let's carry on. Nine points. Halfway to another level. Yeah, if you like, if I get into a fight for some reason and I'm in the grass because I, I, the, my controller vibrates while while in the grass, like it it just keeps vibrating at, even in battle. There, you can see it, that big tree. That's what I was telling you about. That's where we punies live. That's home. Of course, it's not just us in the tree. Lots of jabbies and piters, too. And pitters. Well, anyway, Mario, follow me. What's this? In coupon, really? Can I sell something to this guy? I can't sell. You're lame. Uh, I don't really know if I wanted to drop anything, though. Sorry, Coops. Let's sell this. Back to the puny tree. The great tree. I like the little, the rainbow colored grass. It shit looks awesome. All right. Uh, well, take a look. This door wasn't here before. Someone just installed it. And I can't open it. I thought I could finally save everyone. Am, am I a fool? I'm a fool. Hey, don't take it so hard. It does look sturdy, though. What do we do now? Uh. Hmm. Uh. Got it! Mario over here. Oh, got it! Mario over here. I thought he was like, Mario, you're gonna do something about it. Long ago, the puny other told me about a secret entrance somewhere around here. We'll get in that way. Uh, problem is, I doubt finding it is going to be easy. I mean, it won't be labeled secret entrance. Not to don't, not to be a worry wart, but how in the heck do we can we find this secret entrance? Well, it is hidden by this invisible thingy. We need to find and remove the thingy. Boy, but removing a normal thingy sounds tough enough, let alone an invisible one. Um. Oh, I got it! Flurry! Surely Madame Flurry's powers can help us. Flurry is a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. The Elder says she's a wind spirit and can wield the powers of the air with ease. You see where I'm going with this? She can use wind power to blow the thingy away. Well, it won't hurt to try. Flurry lives in the deepest corner of the woods, so let's head back to the direction we came from. Ah, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. Building a house here was just the finest I idea I ever did have. Oh my, yes! Is this flurry? This place is so different from the bright flash bulbs of the world I'm used to. Such peace. This negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. What? But what's even better is that I, Madame Flurry, grow ever more lovely here. Plus, those squishy, adorable little punies that live in the, that tree are so nice to me. But, I suppose if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak. I already feel the need for drama. That moment of exhilaration when the spotlight shines down on the stage. On me. Surely I was born to be 
an actress for the ages. <laughs> it's settled then. I shall arise again. But before I make my stage come back, I simply must whip my body and mind into shape. I'll just have to put on some makeup before and make my beauty even more beautiful. Wait a moment. No! It's gone! Gone, I tell you! My... My... Oh no. Is it her makeup? Oh boy. Well, what's gonna happen here? I don't know. But, we're gonna have to end it there for this video. Don't miss the next... Or, next video. Where... Ooh, okay, well, let's see. Hold on, I'm sorry. Don't go yet. If we head east from here, we'll see Flurry's place in no time. Oh, that was it? Really? Okay, that's all you had to do? I figured that, because we came from this way. Okay, whatever. Fine, the game is just helping out. That's cool. But, like I said, we're going to end it here. Next episode, we're going to go find Madame Fleury and go save the punies. So, don't miss it. Why? Because it will be dramatic. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. Comment down below whatever you'd like to comment. And hit the subscribe button to support the channel. Also, hit the little bell button by the subscribe button. So, when I put more stuff up, you'll know about it. I hope everybody has a great day. But, most importantly, remember to stay dramatic. Thank <laughs> you.